tutorial, we'll make a cheeseburger notebook and polymer clay pen decorations. Let's make two similar cardboard circles for a notebook. Use any appropriate object as a template. Place hollow fiber filler into the center of a square felt piece. Press over with a cardstock circle and wrap with the fabric. Fasten with an elastic band. Cut off the excess felt. Sew down to fasten the fabric. Remove the elastic. Cut off the excess. The upper burger bun half is ready. Make the bottom half in the same way. Take less fiber. Thus, it is thinner. Let's brown the bun with orange paint dissolved in water. Pour the mixture into a spray bottle. Spray the paint onto the bun halves. Make sesame seeds by twisting tiny felt pieces between your fingers. Attach them with a hot glue gun. Trace the circle template on light green paper to mark off the right size. Cut out a random outline to imitate lettuce. Attach the lettuce to the bun. Make Swiss cheese with holes from a square yellow felt piece. Attach on top. Add the lettuce to the bottom bun half. Make pages from paper of different colors. Red, brown, white, and green. Trace the template on a sheet folded in half. Put the pages in a pile to sandwich the brown pages, imitating a burger, with the white ones for mayonnaise, green for cucumbers, and red for tomatoes. Punch a hole. Fasten the pages with a binding ring. Hot glue the upper page to a bun half. Repeat for the bottom part. It looks great and delicious. We should make unusual pens and pencils to write in this original notebook. Let's make a cheeseburger shaped pencil decoration. Start with changing the polymer clay color. Scrape some beige pastel. Dip the clay into the powder and knead well to get a smooth color. We'll make colors of the clay details using pastel in the same way. Shape the bun halves. Roll out green clay flat to form the lettuce. Trim the edges to get the right size. Attach to the bun using modeling tools. Define the lettuce shape. Put the brown burger on top, covered with a thin yellow square for cheese. Imitate melting with the tools. Add red pieces for the tomato slices. And green ones for the cucumbers. Make onion rings from a thin white strip. Add polymer clay gloss varnish into the white pastel powder and mix well. Cover the cheeseburger imitating the mayonnaise. Add the red powder to make the ketchup. Apply on top. Place the bun. Brown the cheeseburger with the orange powder using a dry brush. Cut a thin strip into the sesame seeds. Apply a varnish coat on top. Make a pencil pit before baking. Follow your polymer clay instructions as for the baking time and temperature. The cool cheeseburger shaped pencil decoration will perfectly match our same shaped notebook. Make a lemon color detail for another pen decoration. Shape a circle with a round top. Make two more elements for shortcake in the same way. Sandwich the lemon cake between the pink ones. Cover the shortcake with the white topping. Imitate melting with the tools. Use a sharp tool or toothpick to create a sponge cake pattern. Cover the shortcake with the varnish. Decorate the cake with chips of different colors. Mold the strawberry in the red clay. Make the berry pattern with the sharp tool. 
Cover it with a mixture of the red pastel and varnish. Add white dots to make the strawberry look natural. Like you did for the cheeseburger, make a pen pit before baking. Now, the pen is decorated with the lovely strawberry shortcake. These funny polymer clay pen decorations and creative cheeseburger notebook will cheer you up even on a rainy day. Feel free to comment, share your impressions, give your thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe to our channel to find more amusing ideas to inspire your creativity.